Hi there, this is Ranjit from tech2bus.com and in this video, we're going to test the boot time of with Windows 7 using this Kingston HyperX SSD. I've been testing this SSD now for uh, almost a month and today we're going to look at the boot times that we can get on Windows 7 system with this SSD. And start. Just uh, look at the stopwatch. and it's done so approximately it took just about nine seconds so as you can see the boot times are incredibly fast with this kingston hyperx ssd one pro tip i have for ssd users is that if you are basically migrating your data from your traditional hard drive to a ssd using a cloning software you might not get good boot time results due to the difference in the sectors of a traditional hard drive and a ssd for example even with this kingston hyperx HyperX SSD, when I was using the cloning software, the boot times were incredibly long at approximately 23 to 24 seconds. So if you want to get the best boot times with your SSD, it's advisable to do a clean install of your operating system. I hope you found this video helpful. If you found it helpful, I'll appreciate if you click on the like button given below. You can also subscribe to my channel to be notified about my future videos. That's it for now. This is Ranjit for tech2bus.com and hopefully I'm going to see you in my next video.